So somebody asked me who's going to take control of the Senate and I started the reading, had to pause it and then forgot to restart it. So I'm just going to go over it as it is, as I have the cards. So I pulled an Oracle card first and I got this one, Orphaned. It is a number five, which means change. In the center, first card I pulled was the Emperor. Red, very red. This is a very red card. And the question I asked was, will the, will the next Senate be red or blue? So, and I use red. Red for me is Republicans and blue for me is Democrats. So then the next card I got acrossing the emperor, challenging the emperor, was the Wheel of Fortune, which is change, sudden and abrupt change. Underneath, in the subconscious, I got the Ten of Swords, an ending, and an ending to the red. In the past, Seven of Wands, which is red, that was in the past. We had a Republican-controlled Senate in the past, and then above it all, death transition. Transition right above this emperor. Near future, restriction, eight of swords, interference. So this is telling me, well, it's telling me a couple of things. It tells me somebody might be going to jail. It also tells me that there was a plan that is being thwarted. In the U position, I got the King of Wands, and that would be Trump, or just the Conservatives, or this could be Mitch McConnell, actually. This is probably Mitch McConnell. Surrounding him, Ten of Cups, blue. The energy surrounding him is blue, and not only that, but it's upside down, and the cups are pouring right on top of him, pouring out on top of this red energy. Hopes and fears, justice. Again, pointing down towards this person here. And then the outcome, Six of Cups. Again, pouring down. Pouring down on this whole reading. So, blue. Blue is the outcome. The outcome is the Senate is going to be controlled by Democrats. And somebody is going to feel orphaned. Somebody is going to feel orphaned. Thanks, guys.